Hello friends and welcome to another video. I'm going to try to speak really fast because me and Big Sis together mean shopping. So we went shopping a bit um, for the Sephora VIB sale and I wanted to show you the stuff we got. I hope I've got everything with me because um, I'm filming this quite, um, when after we've, you know, they're not in our shopping bag. This is after we've unboxed everything and put it in our makeup bag some of them have been used and now looking back i should have done it immediately when i had the boxes and everything i went around and looked for my boxes so the first thing in no order is this burberry perfume i needed this burberry perfume um i needed perfume and this is the one i got it smells really nicely and it looks really good this is what it looks like i love the smell it's the my burberry or the perfume Natural spray vaporizer is 1.0 fluid ounces and I just love the way it looks. I've gotten a bigger one but I got this size because my mom has Coco Chanel Mademoiselle which smells amazing and this was what I went to the store to get and then I smelled that one and then I couldn't decide. So instead of getting the bigger size that I would usually get I got two small ones which is slightly more expensive to do that to get two small ones than to get one big one but then i get two different scents so again another very beautiful one this is what it looks like coco chanel mademoiselle so and then i got primer because this is the primer i use currently and it is after some time it makes the makeup kind of starts dragging down my face so i needed a new one and my sister had been using this for a while and she said it was really good matte for oily people oily if you are dry don't go near this because it's extremely matte makeup makeup forever professional paris step one skin equalizer base mattifying primer and this is what it looks like um Again, I got the small one because I had two recommendations and I couldn't decide. So I got the small one so that I could get another small one. And this is basically the matte version of this. A Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. Really good. They're both really good. I do think I prefer the Smashbox one though with the few uses I've got out of it. And then... I also got the Match Raved About Urban Decay All Nighter and this is what it looks like. It looks pretty old even though it's almost full up. I may have used it maybe once because it stains very easily and so once you apply your makeup and you pick it up to spray it stains. So Kemeta Ethiopica Shea Butter thing I forgot to bring with me but then there's this Bobbi Brown uh, highlighter it's called bronze gold it's called bronze glow it's a very beautiful one and this is what it looks like it's really nice i love it on my uh what about this line on your nose it's called i love it nas creamy radiant concealer very common on youtube um this is medium dark so Nothing to talk about there, very common. And then the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz Pencils. Very, very, if you are really bad with your makeup, these are great. They're originally, I think, $20, $21. If you suck at doing your, if you are really good at doing your makeup, then you probably don't need these. You can get something cheaper. But if you suck, these make it really easy. Um, one of them, they have that spool thing at one end. And then the actual thing but the angle makes it a lot easier to draw your eyebrows if you suck and then the again from anastasia baby hills oh and that color is dark brown this is a pro pencil eyeshadow primer and color corrector and this is what it looks like you can use it to highlight your brow once you draw in your brows And then for more concealer, Tarte Ship Tape. Tarte Ship Tape. Ship Tape. Ship Tape. <laughs> it looks very beautiful. So if you like purple and gold, Laura Mercier again, baking powder. 
but this was a free gift from Sephora so if you shop a lot they give you free stuff it's for baking and then the pore professional this is for sister who thinks her pores are big so she likes it if you think your pores are big maybe you can try it I I showed you the one I use this is not for eye how dry <laughs> and then clear brow gel against an again Anastasia so the Anastasia thinks I brow stuff are really good if you suck again because they are quite pricey and if you don't suck you can get the same results with cheaper stuff but if you suck they make it really easy so this is the like clear mascara for the eyebrows put your brows there, okay. you know as you are working if you have eyebrows and eyelashes like mine as you are working they become like this but this will keep it there you know and then this is for drawing that winged eyeliner again if you suck this is great because like it's very wet and the payoff is great and it's very thin and it's just really nice and um, again if you do not suck you may not need something this fancy you can get something cheaper the elf one dollar ones uh, this is the razor sharp long wear liquid eyeliner and it's dark force and it's really nice it has some glitter in it a shimmer and it's a really thin thing and it's just again if you have the money to spend on it and you suck and you want to look good and then the urban decay eyeshadow primer lotion again another very popular product on youtube to prime the eye before you put your eyeshadow on and um maybe if you have more expensive eyeshadow it may not be necessary but if you have really cheap eyeshadow and the color peel like for example the bh cosmetics uh, eyeshadow palette that i have it looks really good here but color payoff sucks and when you put it on your eyebrow you can barely see anything so using this underneath and then also wetting your brush helps but if you have um you have the chanel eyeshadow you don't need much help mascara again if you have very if you are blessed and all your features look good and you just need little help you know then you are blessed and you can invest in cheaper things and it'll still look really good but if you have crumpled disarranged eyelashes like most of the people in my family do then you may need a more expensive mascara and so look at how this looks it's really good for those of us who need a lot of help can you tell is it Givenchy to the exciting stuff lips yeah don't want excited <laughs> Ooh, how do you know exciting stuff the Anastasia Beverly Hills li liquid lipsticks the ones with the black heads are lip glosses and the one with the silver heads are liquid lipsticks so starting with fewer the lip glosses this one is warm bronze lip gloss looks very good on there's no need for me to try it on because i look good today great because they are 16 dollars get 0.16 ounces for 16 dollar bottle which you could argue is a lot but for quality lip products it's not too bad that's about that's the same price actually cheaper than mac lipsticks the great thing about these things is highly pigmented so very very highly pigmented the color payoff is great hence you need only a little bit to go very far so these will last you a long time and i personally like them because they are great toppers even the ones that maybe except for this but the ones that are called even lipsticks even the ones that are supposed to be lipsticks in my opinion are very great toppers so this is anesthesia baby hills the color is warm bronze it's a very beautiful color um hard to describe because it's a mix of looks like a mix of many 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 things and this is one of my favorites this absolutely beautiful gold color that's it's called gilded it's just a very beautiful topper just gives you a glow just makes you like if you use this and you use the bobby brown 
uh -huh, bronzer people are going to be looking at you no the bobby brown highlighter people will think you're pregnant because people just keep saying you got a pregnancy glow you got a pregnancy glow but it's just makeup to the lipsticks the first one is craft and it's this what's this color fuchsia fuchsia <laughs> purple pink it's just this very beautiful color called craft so first color and then these two that i really really like they look actually look great on their own but they look great together too um this first one is sepia and this one is ashton so sepia and ashton um you get great use out of them great wear <sighs> very appropriate for a lot of occasions even interviews where you want to be subtle they can be used club parties date night boyfriend husband so great and that's it for this vib haul everything is on sale during the vib, yeah. VIB sale let's keep our fingers crossed for a bigger sale the next time and i'll see you in my next video bye, -bye.